Welcome to Video Recon, and if you are the type that loves camping, then I have something great for you. If you just got done watching Loop A, then we are now on Loop B, and this is the full hookup site for Strawberry Reservoir. And just a word, it's not the best for water access, but it has those hookups. And that is what everyone loves to have, especially when they're bringing the trailer along and they have a full family. Now, again, all these sites are pretty well spread out. There's a little bit of privacy. There is actually 27 sites on this loop. And if you notice, they actually have a little bit of bigger pavilions on this one for the campsites. Again, they have flushing restroom facilities uh, that you can use with electricity built in. And you get that beautiful skyline, of course, um, throughout. On this other side of the loop, there's a few trees that you can see. So there's a little bit of shade, but be prepared for the sun and come prepared to shade your trailer or uh, to cover up. Again, you can go hiking, fishing, uh, you can go boating. Uh, there's a lot of things you can do here. You can paddleboard during the summer and during the heat of the summer, you can actually swim in the shallows. Just be careful because it does get cold out towards the middle of the lake. So we're actually already halfway through this one. It's a pretty short little loop, but it has them good old hookups again. And this is a privileged site. My in-laws and I have tried to reserve this and we have not been able to get a reservation for this loop. It is always full. So you gotta be right on the spot when they start releasing sites. And typically people camp here um, a little bit more extended. So that's another reason why it's hard because they have hookups, they stay for a long time. You can stay for up to 21 days at a time without leaving. So yeah, you can see all the trailers, perfect place for RVs. And there is a little bit of access to the lake, but not like A and, and you'll see some of the other loops coming up. Man, I love this place. Again, we come here at least once a year and it's so close to other campgrounds and lakes like Soldier Creek and Renegade is on the other side of the lake and it's a quiet campground. And there's so many trails and so many little dirt roads that you can take to explore. And, you know, there's another place that you may not be aware of, and I'll probably do a video in the future, but there's a place called The Ladders. They actually have trout spawning in this lake, and they actually climb this little ladder that's built into the Strawberry River. And you can actually go see the salmon climb that ladder. It's a great place for catch and release because when they're spawning, you cannot keep fish. Another reminder, be careful with your fires. They're not always welcome depending on the conditions. And so honor all those rules. Thank you for watching the video all the way through. This is Video Recon. Please subscribe to the channel if you like this video. And if you're still not convinced or you wanna see more of why Strawberry is the place for you to take your family and go camping, then I suggest you stick around for loop C, which we'll be getting momentarily. So thanks again for watching, and we will catch you on the next video. Bye for now.